On the project, businesses from France, Germany and Canada work together. That this exoskeleton is hailed as revolutionary is hardly surprising. Makers claim it's cutting edge and innovative, making it appropriate for both law enforcement and military usage. Exom has a number of benefits. First of all, it can disperse up to 70% of the user's burden, making it comfortable for a police officer to carry up to 90 kilogram. Second, at 10 meters away, it can sustain fire from a Kalashnikov weapon. Thirdly, permits nearly unhindered mobility. Even better, it doesn't need batteries because it's a passive model. There are rumors that the French Gendarmerie's elite anti-terrorist force, the GIGN, may be using XOM. Bilan is an anti-tank facility in addition to being a soccer team and a center of worldwide fashion. Engineers from France and Germany created it and it's useful for installation on cars as well as physical labor. The missile's range varies depending on the type, reaching up to 3 kilometers. Milan continues to be praised for its exceptional dependability even after many years of existence. More than 90% of missiles launched find their target. Milan is capable of taking down armored vehicles with homogeneous armor and dynamic protection up to 1,000 mm, even with its modest missile speed. To produce the alien's blood for the 1987 Predator film, visual effects professionals combined glow stick liquid with jelly. We now wonder what kind of camouflage the Italian business Pro Apto deployed. Even aliens may be tricked by it, it seems. Examine these tests for thermal images. Up to 27 meters, its camouflage is quiet, breathable and waterproof. At 400 grams, the lightest model is the lightest. It will be available to both military and civilian clients when manufacturing begins this summer. The anticipated price of the base model is $10,400. RUAV that resembles an eagle has been created by the Dutch firm Guard from Above in the meanwhile. The drone was built in response to comments from the military. It wasn't just an idle thought. In addition to its distinctive look, the UAV has respectable features with a full battery, it can fly for an hour and achieve speeds of up to 60 km per hour. In approximately three minutes, it can be built and manually launched, including a 4K camera for first-person perspective. At the back of it is a cargo compartment. All of this sounds fantastic, but we're curious how actual eagles would respond if mass production and usage of their robotic counterparts were to occur. In 2020, India has over 2 million police personnel keeping the country peaceful. Who will take care of the protectors themselves though? Naturally, the local business making these shields is SMPP. The Karastop 4 model resists 7.62 by 54 mm R bullets with strength. It has impact absorbing foam inserts and straps let you to fasten it as needed to free up your hands. Additionally, there is an attachment for a system to hang shields. By joining many shields together, officers may build a mobile fortress. Furthermore, the design is ideal for shooting from both a sitting and a standing position behind the shield. The X-Series modular shelters may be tailored to your specific requirements, be it a camp for search and rescue, a command center, or a field hospital. Built strong, they can withstand gusts of 24 meters per second and snow loads of 23 kilos per square meter. Every shelter in the premium X40 variant offers 81, 4 square meters of area. Furthermore, according to deployed logics, six individuals can set up the X40 in just 25 minutes. These US-made shelters have been placed in 11 Latin American and Caribbean nations to accommodate Hurricane Dorian victims and boost pandemic relief operations via the International Medical Corps. It's not as simple to build a universal floating bridge as it seems. NATO nations are always changing their standards. And Kinem, a French corporation, is making the necessary adjustments. 2021, a new generation of floating bridges capable of supporting heavy tanks such as the Leopard 2A7 and the Abrams M1A2 was launched. One remote control system is all you need to operate the bridges, which have their own engines. The French army is already using the bridges seen in the video. Additionally, Poland has put several hundred meters of bridge into service. It's interesting to note that these bridges were intended primarily for air travel, yet they can be useful for non-aviation purposes as well, 
such as temporary ferries or routine bridge maintenance. Regarding drone defense, the Israeli business Skylock is advancing in this area. They volunteer to utilize the wearable detector called Wingman, Skybeam gun in unison. Let's examine the pistol in more detail. The worst part is that, like other comparable guns, Skybeam prevents the UAV from receiving and transmitting data, thereby making the drone uncontrolled. With a range of about 3 kilometers, Skybeam has a greater range than many of its rivals. The pistol may be charged while in use and runs for one hour on a full battery. The cannon weighs only 6 kilos, which makes it convenient for one person to carry, and it can run on two separate power sources. Check out Rosoboron Export's Russian Technologies. It's an innovative container. It can produce a smoke screen that is around 25 meters in diameter and 4 meters high in a matter of seconds. This screen, which lasts for at least 20 seconds, interferes with infrared, night vision, and laser range finders in addition to providing visual concealment. The main benefit of the container is its adaptability. It is a reliable option for a variety of circumstances, including crowd control, and it is compatible with both ordinary and armored vehicles. Zipmast, a German firm, recognizes the value of intelligence, thus the ZM10 Neo 60 mast system is available. Up to 10 meters can be reached by raising radars, sensors, and other equipment with it. It may be mounted on vehicles such as the Ziesel Infantry Support Vehicle or put up in a forest. The Ghost Hood camouflage uses findings from perception studies to take care of fitting in. In other words, the creators take into account how people view things. A fascinating new member of the Rheinmetall Mission Master family joined in 2021, the XT Mission Master. This was no ordinary line of unmanned vehicles. It was built to help soldiers in inclement weather and difficult terrain. With the XT model, the German manufacturer really gone above and beyond. It can transport up to a ton of freight and travel up to 750 kilometers without refueling, making it more than simply an autonomous swamp vehicle. Additionally, it has an integrated tire inflation mechanism that can handle punctures up to two millimeters in size. Regardless of the snow, the Mission Master XT can handle anything, including ice, water, dirt, sand, and rocks. In addition, you may recline in a foldable chair and control the car with a joystick if autonomous driving becomes challenging. Elbit Systems, an Israeli business, is becoming well known in Germany and beyond with its products. The Netherlands and other member states of NATO are eager consumers. Their main product line consists of night vision goggles and monoculars. Consider the precise NV32 monocular. It has a 40-degree field of vision and a battery life of around 53 hours. With the IR laser illuminator included, the identical NV32 weighs less than 210 grams, which is 40% less than the previous generation. For increased comfort, the goggles and monoculars may be adjusted from minus 6 to plus 2 diopters. These are good advancements that lessen the fear of driving during nocturnal off-road operations. The Telemax Evo Plus robot's tagline reads, Designed by experts for experts. This tracked machine has a lifting capacity of 80 kg, a top speed of 5 km per hour, and a battery life of up to 12 hours. For excellent situational awareness, operators receive an HD camera with pan, tilt, and zoom capabilities. The Telemax Evo Plus can easily withstand 45-degree glances because to its adaptable tracks. Even in difficult urban environments, good communication is ensured by the integrated mesh system. Aerovironment, a major Pentagon supplier and American defense contractor, is the manufacturer of these robots. Regular viewers may remember Anduril Industries from when its jet-powered drone was able to reach speeds of up to 1,120 km per hour. It's not a good idea, though, to put all your eggs in one basket. In addition to the Swift drone, the business is developing Sentry, a solar-powered, 10-meter-tall drone counteraction system. Sentry, equipped with an array of antennas, radars, cameras, and thermal imaging devices, utilizes Lattice, an artificial intelligence software platform, to handle data. Then, 
Anvil Kamikaze drones are sent to destroy the detected UAVs. Sentry can be dismantled and stored in a pickup truck. It takes less than an hour to set up as well. These towers might be used to build a smart wall along borders or surrounding military installations. The key to developing the ideal portable radar is figuring out what users require. Compactness and low weight are important for the military. The majority of civilian clients want cheap and simple integration. Combine all these requirements and you have the ground observer. 12. This 26-kilometer range pulse Doppler radar made by the French firm TAs is simple to connect to standard PCs using cable or Wi-Fi. It works well with batteries, generators, and other 24-volt sources in terms of power. The radar is self-sufficient and can be set up in five minutes by one person.